Relax. Relax, relax, relax. We're keeping it real with the Millers. I'm Monica. I'm Morgan. And today we are live. We love to do live, live videos. Give it a little bit of time to see if anybody comes in. We didn't really give people much notice. I won't be up. Okay. I always check just to make sure that it's like showing up. So it's being weird. It's being all weird. Weirdy weird. Weirdy weird. Okay, so um the plan for today is we got some fake friend mail. There's, I think, some nummy stuff. So we're going to see what's in here and try it. Oh, Grandpa is here. <laughs> and then, of course, we got some Shop Goodwill, which is probably Disney, Disney jewelry. Hope. You hope? Yeah. Hope it's not something else. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then, what else? Oh, I did get, I've reached out to a couple subscription box people who do subscription boxes to see if um, they would like to collaborate with us. And so Julie's here. Hi, Hi. Julie. Um, and I haven't heard back from a lot of them, but one of them today said definitely they would send us a box that they checked out our channel. Going on Grumpy's here. Um, I'm getting your stuff ready. It will be mailed out this week, promise. Um, but they, so we have one company that is going to send us their box as long as we review it by November 30th. So that shouldn't be a problem. So that will be kind of cool too. Yeah. So yeah, that's kind of our plan for today. Um, we we're hoping maybe Carol would show up. Hopefully she's not in the hospital. So. <laughs> Barb, I'm sending you something. <laughs> I already have started. I, I already think I know what I'm sending you. So I think I found something. I don't have a, a ton of Star Wars stuff, but I was going through something. I found a Star Wars thing that I'm going to send to you. I just today was like missed it. So I'm going to mail it tomorrow. But so that's kind of our plan. How are you guys today? I was going to mess it with. In the message, Carol. Message her and see if she can come all just open her thing. But I have been, since yesterday, cleaning Disney jewelry. I have a sinus infection, so I went to urgent care today, got on some meds, so I'm feeling a little bit better. But, Sue. Oh, what should we do? Should we wait? Sure. Are you going to be able to make it? Yeah. She's hungry, <laughs> and she's, how do you, what do you say it? Tired. Hangry. 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 Hungry and tired and angry. Watch out. <laughs> oh, my. Okay. Should we do this first, then? Sure. All right. So we're going to wait on our friend mail and see if our friend comes. Ugh, get their scissors. So we'll open this up. See if, oh, we got seven viewers. Well, six. We always forget. Count our sales. Maybe. Maybe. That's a dangerous combo, yeah, especially with her. Hungry. Tired, not feeling well, and autism. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Carol can come on in five, so you just got to wait a little bit. Yeah. All right. Okay. So, ooh. Let's this? see what we got. So this was called a Disney Cinderella theme fashion jewelry and more. And the total price, so the price I for the auction was $31. <gasps> Angie, you missed it. I'm starting to feel better. The meds are kicking in. My tummy, I don't always do well with meds, but 
I'm starting to feel better. It doesn't like feel like it's like on fire in here anymore. So that's nice. So, so with shipping and handling, the total for this lot came to $39.83. So, yeah. I know. And we have like, what, two more? Yeah. And there's more coming. Plus, I've been like cleaning like a mad lady because um, I need to, I want to get it listed. And I don't get to list tomorrow. Tomorrow I get to work at my other job, my other business. I get to do a training all day long, which is fun. I like doing this. What do I like to do? All right. We really sealed this. Bunch of people here. A bunch of people. Angie, Michael's my dad. There. Make sure. So they like packaged it up pretty nice. Disney, yeah. I noticed they've been doing that more, like writing down, like writing on there what it is. All right, so we got our garbage bag. So sometimes we find garbage, and then we got our bag that we'll put it in, and then I always at the end put it in this. So then I keep it, and then I'll put in my little. Thing on here and then what I do is I figure out how many pieces I have I'll write that down and then I divide that to figure out how much per piece I have to like that's my cost <laughs> so first is the Cinderella Walsh which this part is metal that's cold um, so I've been, as I've been cleaning, I've been also like, I bought like a bunch of battery, like watch batteries by like the, like a hundred of one of each. Like there's a lot of different watch batteries. I did not realize that. Um, but, and I have the tool that helps you kind of snap off the back, which is the, one of the hardest parts. And then I kind of will clean it up, but popping these backs on can be so hard, so hard. So I have a couple now that I can't, I was trying to pop it back on, remember? Yeah. I have two of them I can't get back on there. So I'm like, this is so frustrating. And the first time, yes, there are tons of batteries. Um, wow. It was like one of my first lots that I tried to fix the battery for. And I, one of them, I couldn't get it on. And so I had my mom try. She and then, no, then she took, I'm like, take it to work and see if one of the guys can do it. But no, she had this idea that, oh, if she just hammers it, it'll be all right. And she busted up the whole, this whole part cracked. So I found that you could, can buy these things where you put it in there and you push it down and it pops it. So, yeah, I just bought one of those. So that's a must if you're going to change batteries because the backs are so hard. Libby says, does Disney jewelry sell really well, or are you just a Disney fanatic? Class, well, both. <laughs> both. I love me some Disney. Love me some Disney. Um, but Disney jewelry sells really well. So, like, I'm trying to think. I sold a Disney vintage watch for, what was it, $100? I think so. And then just last week, in one day, I sold two Disney pins, one for, like, 60 and one for, like, 80 just a pin, just a little pin, or not a little, but the, a pin. So Disney jewelry does sell. I today sold a Disney um, ornament, a metal ornament that I got in one of these. Um, I sell at least one, if not more, I, of Disney jewelry weekly. Like, so, yeah, it sells. And for me, the thing is, is that usually my price is not more per item than $5. It's usually between two to $1. So yeah, I have no complaints. It Some of it sits for a while, but I usually on a few pieces make my money back on a lot. Um, and then they sit there and they eventually will sell. So yeah, I, I love it. Plus I love it. It's like stuff I, I like to see what's in there. I like to take the pictures. I like, you know, so I it's my thing. It's my thing. I don't do many auctions on the Disney. I just do straight price. I haven't done many auctions, no. I'm trying to think if I've done any. I think there was a few, but they don't always do that well. So, but nope, I usually don't. So, 
Yeah, it doesn't take up that much space. And like I said, I think we all find our niches of what we'd like to do. Like Angie is really good at her vintage jewelry and like finding the things that she likes and she can kind of spot it. I am not so well with that. And I think if you find stuff that you like and that you have like an interest, like then it makes the whole job, the whole process. Like I was explaining to my mom the whole process of like, I know Angie lists on Etsy, but for us that list on eBay, like there's a process and I'm sure for her too, right? We had to find the items and then we had to sort through it and then we had to clean it and then we have to inventory it. Then we have to take pictures of it and then we have to do our listing and then we have to put it away, right? We have to do all those things. And so I noticed like if it's stuff that I'm just like, I'm just doing it because I have it, it takes me a lot longer than when I do like Disney, when I do Disney stuff because <laughs> I'm enjoying it more. So let's see. Andy says, so you asked 80 and 60 for those pins and got those prices. No. So I asked higher and then they made me offers on both pins. And so that's what, well, that's what happened. So <laughs> she likes paying bills. I know you like paying bills. I make, I sell a lot of other stuff too. What just before, just today from when I woke up to now, would I ship out five items today? I think so. Yeah. And they were in all Disney. So, I mean, that's just part of the game. But that's the first thing. All right. This is really cute. <laughs> that's a cute little pin. Um, yes. There were comps. So what I do, like I'm sure we all do with comps, like I look for um, similar items and I'll try to go a little bit lower or if there wasn't like, sometimes you find pins that there are none listed, but some have sold. And then um, sometimes I'll, so I'll list it for what it sold for. Or sometimes if there's none listed, then I'll list it for a little bit higher because it's, obviously rare or not so that's how yep i do it and then this is a really cute blingy watch i don't know that it's i don't think this is disney it looks like it's ann klein though i don't know about ann klein um rolling pick is here no you haven't missed much here i'll even show you what you missed rolling picker just for you this watch because you only missed two things and this pin, which is really cute. I don't know if Anne Klein does very well. That just blows me away that Disney sells that high. I never would have guessed. Now, some of it doesn't. Like, right? Some of it sells, like, some of our pins sell for, like, $6. Or, like, I had this ornament. It was a metal ornament that sold. I think I sold it for 14 with shipping. So, sometimes this, but then you do. You find rare items that sell. Watches I can usually make about nineteen dollars or sell them for like twenty bucks sometimes more. So yeah, I mean I do all right. This was the me. I don't know why, but this was one of the things that caught my eye. I caught my eye too. I know it's yeah. like it's so cute that I've never seen it. Now, I don't keep much of the Disney jewelry. Usually I keep pieces that are maybe missing some stones that I still think are cute. I don't know why I'm here. I hate jewelry. Oh, because you love me and Morgan. But this was really cute. Well, that's cute. And it's on a chain. What is your product? Dwayne. Dwayne, Dwayne. Dwayne. So that was cute. You love jewelry, Michael. He, I know. Michael, for somebody who says you don't love jewelry, you buy so much of it. <laughs> Angie, does um, Ann Klein sell? Or is that like another Avon? How do you say it? Avon. <laughs> Shut up. Avon. No, not all of this is Disney, I'm noticing. But that's okay. That's really pretty, though. That's really blingy bling. Blingy bling. My phone.
phone is like going crazy, crazy, crazy. This has a C on it. Maybe it's good Angie's here. What's the, I'm trying to see, is it one necklace or? Okay. That's pretty. I don't know that I have it right. Can you guys see that? That'd be a statement necklace, right, Ange? Makeup zombie. Oh. Makeup zombie? And Klein will sell, but not for a lot. Okay, what's this? This has, is that Claire's? This has a seed like that. It's cute, though. Pretty. 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 Dawn? Is Dawn here? Oh, Dawn! Probably missed it. Dawn's here. Yeah, okay. So here's another thing. So if you guys ever see something that you want or that you like, like I would love to sell it to you guys and like cut down having to sell it through, you know, eBay. So you can always message me on Facebook um, and we can work out a price and shipping. Another thing is, is that I have so much of just like regular jewelry, like this kind of stuff, I guess. Um, and so I'm thinking about, yeah, I don't know what that C is, but I'm thinking about, um, and I kind of wanted your guys' idea, maybe bringing on like one piece or a bag of pieces and having, um, like selling that, like on here, like selling it to you guys. Tell me what you guys think. We could do like a jewelry auction too. That's another idea. That's really pretty. And they're they feel like glass because it's heavy. But there's the no parents are all here. <gasps> Hi. I think me and Princess Casserole might be doing a collab. Well, that's cute. That's my great. mom's gonna want that. <laughs> that will go to my mom, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure, I'm sure. That's pretty. These are heavy. Heavy. Those beads. Lots of beads in this one. Okay, here's like a Cinderella charm. charm. <laughs> Just coming to see. This is like little beads. Little beads. Beady beads. Like what? Oh. I always can never figure out how these work. Now is this a newer... Like how do you put this on there? I don't know. Like is this like a newer thing? Or is that more vintage? What would you guys say? It's really pretty though. It's got some really pretty beads in it. My phone is like going crazy. I don't know about those. They're like a fake. Pillow. They're pretty though. All right, what's in here? What wedding David necklace? I don't know what that means. Yeah, is that a vintage hook class? This is really pretty. Ooh, come on. Cooperate. That's pretty, though. I don't know what it's got a tag on it. Go to tag. Whiting Davis. I feel like I'm screaming. Am I screaming? Vintage Hook Class, 50s, 60s. Kala. I need to watch more of her videos to see what she likes. We're going to do. Yes, that's what it is, Carla. Is that a good brand? Me and Kala are going to do a collab. We're going to send each other some fun stuff. So that's cool. All right. What else is there? 
that's kind of a mixture of stuff. Look at this. I like this. I like fun pins like oh, this. That is, cool. that is so cool. I mean, I like them, like to find them, and then you know who really likes them? My mom. She likes to steal them and wear them. <laughs> <laughs> Don, I don't know what, why you got, make sure that you had the bell on for everybody. I don't know why that's happening with you. Don, yes, I was yelling. <laughs> I felt like I was yelling. Who's unlucky? What am I missing? I'm not unlucky, Dwayne. Ooh. Okay, is this an older class? I like these class for some reason. But look at this. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty, isn't it? That's like beautiful. That is vintage. This is so pretty, you guys. It's got a little marking. I'll have to look at it more. I really like that. <laughs> She is miserable. She's waiting for Carol so we can eat. <laughs> Carol's taking her sweet time. Carol does not know what she's doing here. Some earrings. Some earrings. I think they go to like one of the neck. There's a bunch of necklaces that these earrings can go to. So you could, do I could do like a whole set of these like blues, white and blues. I know, right? She's hungry. Somebody send her some food. <laughs> this girl's hungry here. Pizza. pizza? We're not having pizza. We're having chili. We're having chili. Mm -hmm. That chili. Hey, it looks like I got two of these. Well, I guess that's a little bit different, but it's that same. Huh? What happened? Hey. <laughs> Oh, gee. <laughs> Calling Carol a bastard? Who's the bastard? Me? Spicy ramen. <laughs> Spicy. No, she wants pizza. I'm going to have pizza tomorrow. Hey. All right. Sorry, guys. So it's like that. These are so pretty. And it's got that really cool class. And this one says something. What's it say? Yale's here. Wagner. Manny or something? Here, I'm going to show it to you guys. I don't know what that is. The man is the bastard. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the man? Gail! Gail, Gail, Gail! I'm going to... Dwayne, you keep getting... Carol's here. Okay, we gotta stop on the joy. Carol, you've made Morgan not ha happy. Not happy. Tell her. I'm hungry. And what? Tired and angry. And hangry. <laughs> and who made it worse? You. <laughs> How I, I thought it was. You, you're never gonna blame Carol, are you? No. <laughs> So Carol did this video where she showed herself. So if you guys haven't seen that video, go check out Carol's channel. Make sure you subscribe to Carol's channel. We're trying to get her to 100 subscribers. And she's been lately doing dumpster dive videos. They are so awesome. But Carol has revealed herself. And she is gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Love Carol. And so does Morgan's cat. Morgan's cat would not let me put down the phone. Um, like put down the phone. Or like look at it she had to be like right next to the phone while we were playing carol's video <laughs> and like be rubbing up against the phone and giving carol lovins on the phone which you don't get many lovins from olive unless she really loves you it was so cool uh, all right so we have a special snacky snack see carol knows morgan gets hungry and we love our food <laughs> um that carol sent us so this will hopefully make Morgan smile. <laughs> or she'll be leaving us to go get food. <laughs> oh, 
Melinda is in the house. In St. Paul, we in Bemidji. Okay, so, oh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Carol, you're going to have to like send me these like once a week just looking at these things. Here is the Black Moon for you to try. They have a new flavor, so I got that too. Do you guys know what Black Moon is? Like, Moon Pies, I love Moon Pies, but I think this is going to be my new favorite thing. Wait till you see these. Whoa. This is a Moon Pie. Oh my gosh, it looks, like it looks so chip. soft. So this one is Chocolate Chip Whoopie Pie. Oh my gosh, wow. Carol. You need to make like a subscription box of these and I want to like, I need these in my life. And then this one is Whoopie Pie, which looks like it's a chocolate one. Okay, so which one is like the original and which one's the new one, Carol? Yeah, oh, White Earth. That's, a, that's I want to say White Earth's like an hour from us. I'm talking about what's vintage. Anything before 1997 is vintage. I need to take a picture of that because I'll forget. I don't know how to work my phone. Nobody talk <laughs> or talk or type. Okay, I took a picture so I can write that down. I always forget what is vintage. I know, but I want to know. They look so good and they're so like feeling how soft they are. Smell. You can't smell them, so that means they're wrapped good. And they're only two for three dollars. What? These things are cheap. I wish we had these. Carol, <laughs> chocolate is the original, so this is the new flavor. But she's the hungry, hungry girl, so she gets to pick which one we're eating. Chocolate chip one. <laughs> okay. So the chocolate one's all for me. So it just so uh, happy. Carol, what do I got to do to, like, get, like, every weekly, flavor. weekly, whoopie <laughs> pie. Yeah, every flavor. Oh, oh, my gosh. These things are huge. Oh. Look at this. Whoa. <laughs> oh. You try it oh, first. smell it. Wow. You're hungry, so you try it first. She oh. wants, she wanted me to try oh it first because she was going to take it. Oh, my God. Oh my, <laughs> that's so good. Mm. Yummy. My gosh. Don't Everybody <laughs> needs to go get them one of these things. These are butter, Carol. You were right. Carol, <laughs> I bow good. down to you. You were right. These are better than moon pies. These are better, 100% <laughs> better than moon pies. Like, I don't think I could eat a moon pie ever again. <laughs> Because these, like, <laughs> oh, my gosh. Those are not for if you're going on a diet. Thank you, Carol. Yum. You made my week. Oh, my gosh, Carol. You guys, go get you some. <laughs> <laughs> yummy, yummy, yummy. Yum. Carol, I really think you need to do a subscription box of finding, like, yummy stuff. You would do awesome. Yeah, you know your sweets. Those are so good. I have no clue, Julie. I don't know where you can buy them from. Carol does. All right, Morgan's going to keep snacking on that. I'm going to show this jewelry. Maybe. We got tangled. She's downing this, Carol. Carol, you gotta send another chocolate chip because, like, I got two bites and that's it. <laughs> yum. Yummy, yum. And the, um, the inside. It's not like a marshmallow. It's kind of like a cream. Yeah, it's like a cream. It's really good. Nope, that other box didn't come. I have to go to a meeting. Tell me if they are good. They're good. They are so good. Okay. How oh, does this? Okay, it's like this. It's kind of tangled. Oh my gosh. And then the cat. 
I have to untangle. Oh, there. So it's a long one. I don't think I can eat it all. I That's gotta fine. save my stomach for supper. We're having uh, white, chicken, chi white chili. chicken chili. It's my mom's thing. You do it in the crock pot. It's really good. This is really cute. And it's really lightweight. It's really blingy blingy. It's got the little seed beads. But it's not vintage. Oh, pumpkin. I love pumpkin bars. Oh. Pumpkin bars are yummy. Mm -hmm. What are we making for? We're making s'mores. Oh, we're going to make s'mores brownies for um, Thanksgiving dessert. I like to, we, I make a pumpkin, like a bar, pumpkin bars, like from, I guess not scratch, scratch, because I use the pumpkin in the can, <laughs> but I like them, because I love the cream cheese frosting. Mm -hmm. oh, cream cheese frosting. Yum. Awesome. Cut it up usually into fours and put it in the back. Well, I'll just show you. I took two bites, and this is what's left. <laughs> so... Yeah, I love everything but peppers. <laughs> All right, next is this, which is really pretty. You don't like raw onions. I don't like raw onions either. And I don't like Brussels sprouts. Eh. <clears throat> Yucky. Not even with cheese. I don't like it with nothing. Nope. It just tastes weird. Oh, yeah, we used to, pumpkin cheesecake. Grandma used to make that. Yeah. Yep, that's really good. And then she uses the sandy cookies as the um, base. Those are really good. Pumpkin seeds are good. Yeah, I like pumpkin seeds too. All right. So now is this Angie? Is Angie still here? If you make it, it's probably good, Dwayne. Yeah, I know, Dwayne. I want to go to Dwayne's house like for a food vacation. <laughs> he can cook. Okay. Is that a vintage class? But those beads are pretty. Pretty, pretty. Ew, no seaweed. Yeah, Grandpa likes pumpkin No cheese. seaweed, Carol. Carol, no seaweed. Come on, you promise. No seaweed. There's not much in here that's Disney, actually. Maybe it's just stuff that looks like it goes with Cinderella. Yeah, kind of Cinderella theme. They are really pretty, though. That's more modern. But it's pretty. It's pretty and blingy. But I love Brussels sprouts. Ugh. Yuck. I'm liking these. These bracelets are really pretty, though. This has a mark on it. But I can't read it. I don't have my thing. Isn't that pretty? It's sparkly. I think the only thing I don't like are stones. Other than that, I love all food. Stones? <laughs> what kind of food is a stone? Maybe, maybe it's scones. Scones. Oh, I don't like scones either. Stones. <laughs> I like stones. I thought that was like a typo. If you have seen me, you know I do not miss many meals. I cannot say in Brussels sprouts. No, but like seeing like some of the stuff you cook or even like your... Um, how you cooking your turkey and stuff. It's all like gourmet. Like you should be a chef. This is really pretty. It's got like a little bow on it. Do not like red or green peppers. Me neither. Me neither, Angie. I'm allergic to them. So I really don't like them. Oh, these are pretty too. Those are pretty. I don't have my ears pierced, but that would really like bling out, right? Yeah. Now I want to get my ears pierced just so I can wear these all the time. <laughs> those not... You can't be. You're allergic. No, I'm allergic. But are those not pretty? Maybe my mom will like those. Those are really pretty. And they're lightweight, too. I would think I will wear earrings lately. And then... That's really pretty, but it needs a... Chain. Chain. But it is pretty. It's pretty. It is pretty. And then there's... These All earrings. Peppers. All peppers. Okay, so I can eat black peppers, like the se like seasoning black pepper, but otherwise I can't eat any peppers. That's pretty too. 
kind of bummed I wanted more Disney in here. There's not as much Disney as I was hoping for. Okay, who's this? Well, that's the Fairy Godmother. Fairy Godmother charm. Mm -hmm. It's like for the charm bracelet. And this is, oh, this is really pretty. Cinderella, and this kind of, I don't know if you can see it, but kind of sparkles. Cinderella's Castle, Magic Kingdom. This is from 2008, it looks like. No spice in my life, no. No spice in my, oh, I get two of these? Look at, I got another one of these. And this one doesn't have a chain. I have to see how much they sell for, but I might have to keep one of these for me to put on my shelf. And then earrings. earrings. I could do some sets with this, I think. Yeah, I can do that. Me too. See, Angie, we have so much in common. Scrapple. What's Scrapple? Scrapple. I've never heard of Scrapple. Me either. Snapple? <laughs> okay, these are pretty too. Really blingy. Do people like blingy stuff? Make sure like there's no stones missing. No stones missing. And then here's Cinderella's castle charm. I've got a few of those. Like blingy, blingy, blingy. And then those, they're kind of pretty too. So that's all that was in this one. I think. Oh, these are different. Look. One's peach and one's pink. You should probably keep the pink one. Oh. Uh -huh. Let's see. That's so. My favorite thing. I like that. That's pretty. That's really pretty. And it's unique. I haven't seen that. Google it. Scrapple. I don't have my phone. <laughs> Scrapple. I was going to text it to Carol. <laughs> <laughs> I think Scrapple is pork trimmings and cornmeal. If I'm not mistaken, it looks like a meatloaf. <laughs> it does look like a meatloaf. There's like all different types of scrabble. Like this is. Let me go to images. Looks like a meatloaf. <laughs> Well, you can buy scrapple like that. Do you cook it in the oven? Oh, my dad knows what it is. <laughs> we'll make some. <laughs> <laughs> we want to try scrapple. You put syrup on it. Well, anything you put syrup on, then is good. Yep. Yeah, pork. I'm hungry for bacon. <laughs> <laughs> I love bacon. Fry it up in a pan. Why do we always end up talking about food on this channel? <laughs> <laughs> so what do you guys think about this lot? Especially since I got some major jewelry people in here. I paid $39.83 for this I lot. I don't think it was worth it. <laughs> okay, Morgan says it's not worth it. 
Well, it said it was supposed to have like Disney stuff in it. It had, it had like, like four Disney. To, like, it said barely. Cinderella. Bacon and cheese. Ew, spam. Gross, Dad. Go away. It says Din Disney Cinderella themed fashion jewelry and more. Yeah. I thought there were some pretty pieces in there, though. Yeah. You tell him, Angie. Tell him he don't know what he... We, Spam, Spam is, is gross. gross. So gross. It's disgusting. Yeah. And we used to live near where it was, where they make it. And I've been in the factory. Mm -mm. I'll never eat Spam again. I don't know what it's made out of. And mom will never try. I like the carriages too. I thought some of the other pieces were really pretty. I think I could make like a lot. Because like the blues and stuff. Mm -hmm. And do some cool lots like that. That maybe people would buy. So, these ones, are those? yeah, those are correcting these ones. These are really pretty. I like some of, like, this was really pretty, too. I don't know if this even does it. Oops. I like this, that. If you guys can even see like how pretty that is. But that is really pretty. And there is a marking on it. I just can't read it. Yeah. I like them. I thought they're fu they're fun. It's a fun lot. It's different. But okay. She's gonna put it away. Away from me. So I think that next time, so we have two more for sure boxes upstairs, right? Is it two more? I think so. I think it's two more of stuff. So we're going to be trying to do that between this week and next week. It's hard when it's like Thanksgiving, right? Right. But um, we're going to do a review video. But I think at the next video that we do i think i'm going to bring um a couple items and see if anybody's interested in them and then they could contact me i don't know i'm trying to see how to I have so much of this like vintage mix not more modern um stuff that i bought that i'm just not like finding myself listing at all and so i thought i'd like to maybe give people who actually like kind of listing that stuff maybe a chance at getting some of it so let me know what you guys think if that's a good idea or not okay angie said tomorrow after the gym i will open my friend mail from nelly that i got today cool i won't be able to watch it live because i'm doing a training all day tomorrow and like 10 30 to 4 30. Sheesh! A, <laughs> it's like six hours of non-stop talking. Talk, talk, talk. But we all know I can talk. <laughs> right? That's not a problem for me. All right. Do you guys have any questions for us? Yeah, I will. I'm already tired. I could go to bed right now, but I want to eat those. Took the antibiotics this morning. It's on the. It's that five day. Like you. But bye, Dwayne. Bye, Dwayne. Love you. Dwayne, get on Morgan's case to do her <laughs> job for you. She's slacking. I don't know where the papers are. All right, we'll find it. All right, we love you guys. Bye. We're gonna go. Bye we'll bye. be on soon. Be looking for jewelry. We're going to try He's to sell some room. jewelry. Cedric's in his room. He just got home from school, so he hibernates and, like, doesn't want anything to do with us. So, yeah. hopefully, him and his sister will play later. Yep, Heather's flowers. <laughs> Heather's flowers. I got to find the paper, and then I'll do it. We'll get it done. Bye, you guys. Bye. Love you. Remember, if you saw anything you like, contact us on Facebook and let us know. Yes, I want more moon pies. More moon pies. Or what? Black, black moons. moons. More black moons.
keep them coming, Carol. All right. Love you guys. Bye. Bye. Remember, keep keeping it real until we see you next time.